Chloe. Which didn't really have a very nice ending. However, I don't know what's going on with all of them. All the, I really don't know. I really don't know what's, what's happening to, to the center of the whole um, attraction, which is Sissy. She was just like in the middle of everything. It all started with her. I think, um, so yesterday, um, we were cooking in the kitchen and um, I realized that she wanted to do the cooking for the house, so I just decided to, you know, step back and I myself was a bit tired, so just let her go and do her thing. So I really don't know what's before me in the house and uh, I, I'm not really that much of a romantic type of guy, like I try to be when I can, I try to be nice, sweet and all, but I don't know if I... If I really hit the romantic thingy on the head, though. Well, actually, I'm, I'm I'm cool with everyone. I'm free with everyone. I try to be nice to the ladies. And, you know, I try to make them smile whenever I can. Uh, I noticed Coco and Anto was just cut to the house recently. And, so, yeah. Um, there's, well, I, I can't say much between me and Coco right now, though. But is there... Some sort of like um, a vibe, chemistry that I get from her sometimes. Yeah, I mean, off and on it comes, but Coco is Coco, you know, you never really know what Coco is up to sometimes. So then again, I, I'm i not saying I'm diving in anywhere, you know, but it's still Rico Suave, still that very nice guy, still that super cool dude guy. So yeah, I'm, I'm just keep on playing it that way, you know. And see whatever outcome it brings but then again I know what I'm here for like I always said I'm focused and keep on my positive energy and that